million tax returns have yet to be processed since 2019 as a result of a pandemic backlog. Like many places, the IRS is short staff and handling an influx of calls. Now, Tenor News Michelle Wolf joins us tonight after speaking with a local tax preparer. Tenor News uh, has been looking into this issue and the situation. Does it look any better for the filings for 2020? Yeah, so I'm told that the turnaround time for returns has actually been pretty quick this year, but there are two new questions that, if not answered correctly, could delay your return several months. I know it happened to me. A speedy process this tax season. That is, if all your information is correct. If you got the stimulus check, the third one, we need that letter, and those letters have been sent out. And if you got the advanced child tax credit. Melinda Wiedenhoff has spent the last 38 years preparing taxes at Jackson Hewitt and tells 10 on your side to double check how many stimulus checks you've received and if you got the third one in March 2021. The same goes for the child tax credit. If it doesn't match, it's going to cause problems. It's going to kick you into an errors and it could be months before you get your refund. If you've already filed and checked the wrong box, you'll need to fill out and mail a paper 1040X form along with your original return, which all said and done, Wiedenhoff says, could take four months or more to receive your amended refund. Honestly, just patience and time because it's going to take time. It has to be physically looked at by a human being at the IRS, and then they would do the errors resolution, correct it, and send out the refund at that time. And if you're still waiting on a 2020 return due to backlog, file your 2021 anyway. For this filing season, even if you don't have last year's return, go ahead and file this year because, as I said, if you don't have any issues, it stays in the computerized system. The refunds have been coming timely, two to three weeks. Um, I actually had a couple clients, they got their refund in eight days. To check the status of your refund, you can go to irs.gov. Michelle Wolf, 10 on your side.